a look at what's happening around Northwest Arkansas like we always do. What's happening today at 1 o'clock, the Community Creative Center in, excuse me, in Fayetteville is offering a free watercolor acrylic, acrylic and painting workshop. That sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah. The event is open to families and children eight and older. So if you're interested, all you need to do is show up at the Community Creative Center at 1245, and then you'll be led to the Lower Ramble, oh, which is really, really nice, uh, to begin the project and return back to the center. You're going to be able to enjoy some hot cider and refreshments. That's going to be at 3, and then workshops are free for Fayetteville residents. I love that. Yes. Hey, tonight is the night we've been talking about for this one for a little while. It's opening night for Chicago at Walton Art Center. It's the one musical that makes Broadway shimmy and shake. The show has received several Tony Awards, two Olivier Awards, Grammys, and thousands of standing ovations. Reminder that limited tickets remain for this show, which opens at 7 p.m. tonight, and it runs all the way through Sunday. Plus, the show is celebrating its 25th anniversary, so it's the perfect time to see it. We did have the chance to interview the cast. You can find that <coughs> interview and ticket information over on our website. Yes, we did. And we'll also talk about another opportunity that you can add on to your Chicago experience. So we'll, we'll head to that a little bit later in the show. Free local theater also set to take place at Center Stage this weekend as the Smokehouse players present Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf? You can catch performances on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday in the chilling room of the old Ozark Mountain Smokehouse in Fayetteville. Any donations taken on opening night will support the work of the Magdalene Serenity House. Now, we did have a chance to interview Jules, Terry, and Tim, so go over to our website to check that out. Yeah, that's right. The Northwest Arkansas chapter of Next Up, formerly new or the network of executive women, is excited to host a virtual lunch and learn focused on Q4 burnout, how to thrive and, and survive professionally and personally. The event will take place this Thursday, November 10th, starting at 1130 over Zoom. The keynote speaker will share strategies for thriving during the hectic holiday season. And you'll also hear from a panel of local business leaders who will share their tools and techniques to remain calm during the chaos. Registration for that <coughs> event is open now. Okay, I love that. As temperatures turn cooler, if you or anyone that you know need a winter coat, head to the Fayetteville First Church of the Nazarene on Saturday while supplies last. They're going to be giving away winter coats and winter items starting at 2 p.m. Alternatively, if you've got a coat or if you've got some items that you want to get rid of, then this would be a great way to make sure that somebody who really needs them receives it. Yeah, I love that. Giving back. Looking ahead to the weekend as a Razorback football team takes on LSU for their battle for the boot. The Arkansas Roller Derby is doing a battle for the boot of their own as they take on Fountain City Roller Derby out of Kansas City. It's a doubleheader match. Doors at Starlight Stadium open at 5 p.m. for the 5.30 game with the A teams. And then after that, the B teams will face off against each other. Adult admission is $10. Kids are $5. And five and under get in for free. If you're interested on this event or to sign up for that Lunch and Learn or for any and all of our happening in NWA stories, all you need to do is head over to KNWA.com and click on the Good Day NWA tab.